okay so the watch the watch was fixed the watch was fixed um this is uh this is what he what he came to i did remove also hands yeah it's not dial right it hands it's hands uh that's gone and uh, i got a different hands on one and um what still needs to be done is the stem here and we need to cut that a little bit shorten that one so it's gonna fit nicely inside but i think it's running about like what now maybe two hours and it did not go wrong for a second so it's done properly this thing it's the way it should be and uh, now that's that and um i just like it like this i like this watch like this better than 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 what it came um the stem was bent actually the stem was the latch the lock from the stem was uh, just as the watchman alone told me just as the police investigators told me you're gonna read on my new side i'm gonna post like a little comment exactly about what they did so that's a nice little portuguese flag i have on the watch that's what that is it's a Portuguese, it's a NATO nylon Portuguese flag. And this here, this is what I fixed. Again, it's running again. Yes, I replaced those hands. I didn't like that. Or dials, or whatever you call that in English. I have no idea. Uh, so, I like it. I would not change the design for this watch, not even for the Rolex simple as this i love it it's really nice i like it um let me demonstrate to you something this is basically what was done right now i'm going to demonstrate to you yeah <laughs> that's kind of a funny stuff when i think about stuff like this i love when people give good advice that's very nice uh, it, it's really useful when you give people help so let me give you a help ad, advice in case you ever get yourself in a stupid situation like this this here is what i actually figured out myself was done then i also record the police uh what they had to say about all this shit. you see this thing here this is this is this is a latch this thing here this and it looks like this uh when you push this thing inside the stem that goes this way um it's done in a such a way that you have to push down like this uh to unsecure the latch enough so that this stem runs like this basically either way unobstructed whichever way it goes in and out when you when you squeeze this thing down you can push in and out in and out that's one of the things i'm gonna say to you and i figure out that because i also recall the scenario from the police that you shouldn't even bother with it because it's going to be too much time consuming yeah 
uh, the watchman whom I have met at the postal office told me, if you're not going to be able to repair this stuff, I will be returning you back your Miota mechanism. So that means that police, the local police department, the police of the novelist that have used this watchman, are rather than police officers, to meet with the postal workers and arrange crime for them, basically on their behalf. Together they exchange uh, packages with the postal officer uh, office, deputized by the police, by the police director Diana Zogolin, and we're doing this kind of crime. Um, this is a problem because it was not only the original Japanese Miota that was stolen to me. You have no fucking idea how many things were stolen in Slovenia from me. So that's a big fucking problem. I have a big problem because it was a lot, a lot of money stolen. In Belarus, nothing came. In Belarus, everything was stolen. But okay, that's Belarus. But this here, this is, this is inside of the European Union. So I would love European officials to pay attention to this stuff. This is not okay. This is not how European Union functions, right? You understand that the packages, international packages, derived from the third countries, do go and through Hungarian postal services and through the German when they enter the European space. And you are actually seen in a very bad light when stuff like this happens to people. This is not good stuff that's happening. So that if I could not repair, uh, if I could not be, both of the mechanisms had this kind of problem, if I would not be able to repair the watch using those mechanisms, that he would go ahead and return me the original Miyota mechanism, movement if you like. So this is a theft. It's actually much worse than theft. So anyhow, so police officers also told me how they did this shit, what he did this stuff. How exactly did it happen, this thing? Well, first, how he did this stuff. He pushed uh, the latch up in a position, in a, in a lock position, take uh, a stem, and have forced a uh, ag uh, stem against the latch. And when he did this, he bent the latch. Then what he did was he forced latched all the way inside, and so it locked inside. Now you cannot put, you can't take any more the latch out. Now I figure out something else. I figure out that this part here where you're supposed to squeeze, um, according to this guy here right but this is basically most of the watches that have this kind of mechanism there are some watches that have different release hand but this is basically on this watch uh i've come to a conclusion about something else to outsmart this crazy police what i did was i i figure out that um the whole thing is yeah, because he forced inside, um, he bent this thing. However, um, he bent, I figure out most likely, um, let's say that this is a latch, right? So uh, something like this, right? So now uh, when you push down, uh, here actually probably is some kind of hole, something like this that allows them this stem to run through. Uh, when you when you push down, you know, uh, hold probably as I stated is a bow. Oh, well, let me demonstrate to you what I mean, because this is this is not. Um, so basically, I have no idea what the latch looks like, but in my head, um, the latch I'm referring to probably looks like, like let's say. Like you would have a key or something like that, right? Like a lock. Um, I have no idea how this stuff looks like, okay? But let's say that it looks like this, right? So 
when you force uh, this stem inside that goes this way let's say yeah the stem goes inside um, the latch which something like this let's say that this is this latch and that you have to squeeze this down yeah that you have to squeeze this down to push this um, stem basically inside yeah stem you have to you have to push down so it's 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 on a level it's on the same level so that you can push through this thing probably something like this right uh, and so I figure out that uh, that he probably bent this sideways um, you know this is a, what we refer to as a profile profile this thing okay so I, I kind of figure out that actually what he did was um, that he pushed out of the way um, so let me do this okay and we're gonna do it like this but I kind of figure out what he did was he bent uh, most likely um, you know this 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 whole uh, um, yeah, it could be whole thing or could be uh, you know it's also possible that he did this shit from a bow right that's another issue Oh, good. That's impossible actually to even know. And the solution I came up with, uh, it actually answers both questions. Whether it would be what they told me he did. In other words, because it doesn't make no fucking difference if you think about. Uh, if he did, in fact, what they told me, right? So therefore... Yeah, yeah, this is actually not even a good picture. Okay, there's got to be something here, maybe even like this. I don't know. Okay, probably even like this. Who knows? I don't know. I <laughs> I didn't go through this stuff. I didn't. I just quickly was trying to get the solution, and it did took me a few hours to get to one, uh, because this was a hell right. I didn't know whether the hell I, what am something I'm doing something wrong or or what's going on I was looking on the internet and I couldn't find any solution uh, I wasn't even sure whether you do this stuff to actually open the lock um, then I got upset then I video recorded the whole thing uh, then I started to think about solution and then finally it came to me that yeah that if you would go rather than just squeeze down this thing as instructed uh rather than squeezing like 90 degree down uh, you would squeeze like this basically okay uh that means that you apply the pressure uh also this way okay so you know sideways zig 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 and when you do that kind of stuff when you do that kind of stuff uh, you actually move the whole thing a little bit, you know, you know what I mean? And at the same time, you move the stem. And that's exactly how I solved the problem. Um, it would be the same solution, even if he would really do what they told me he did, that actually that, um, that this thing was, you know, because this thing goes up, right? Because you, when you... Um, when you pull the stem out this thing goes up right it goes like this you know what i mean so forcing the stem with this without this hole with this hole here that you see um forcing forcing the stem rather through here yeah it will cause some kind of deformation of this latch of this lock yeah because you're not supposed to do that stuff you're supposed to as i said you're supposed to go and you're supposed to press down squeeze down so that the latch would lower itself and would the stem would nicely go through 
So now it doesn't matter whether they did this kind of deformation, deformation, right? Like they told me they would do, or they did this kind of deformation. Well, there is another form of deformation they possibly could have done. It's actually deformation that they might have used this kind of deformation, or let's say this kind of deformation. You see, this too would make difficulty for the stem uh, because it's 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 sideways, right? So it's sideways. Okay, so both of them was screwed up like this. Both of them were screwed up like this. But I figure out, and yeah, it's a nice little watch now, and it's working. Uh, to the last second, uh, very, very accurately. Uh, I gotta say, I've never had a watch uh, as beautiful as this watch. Um, it was a little bit boring to me before in the past, but right now, this is exactly what I would bring in as a watch. I prefer this watch over uh, truly any other, uh, any other watch. I like it. I like it exactly like this with this Portuguese um, NATO nylon strap just like this now that, that we still have to work out a little bit on that one so that's basically what that was so just that you understand how exactly this crime came about the Serbs cried all the time here all the time they cry, oh, help us, help us, you know, help us. But he is this, but he is that. He's a... It was nothing but cry. It was nothing but cry f uh, for help. Politicians, Serbian politicians, nothing but cry for help to local police. Heroes, basically, to the local heroes. Uh, and so the Russians, or <laughs> I don't know. Um, I assume Russians took responsibility, but there is really was no difference when it comes to crime between the Russians and between the Serbs. Russians were the one that, you know, how, how the hell it happened, exactly what I told you. Uh, police officers were fucking around here, demonstrated me uh, that it was not only inside here, they met me in front of the post office and so on, how it's all fucking waste of time, that's impossible to repair and blah, 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 blah. It's just a waste of time, la, 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 la. Um, just the scenarios I told you under MK Ultra have taken place. Even that if you will, uh, if, uh, if somehow that you, if, even if you would repair, that it would be movement that would not uh, go for too long and that kind of stuff. Yeah, you remember because he's a cheap movement and this, that, la, 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 la. Uh, and then Russians came as the last customer. And uh, this, this, this was like, how the hell can I say? Hmm. I, exactly what I explained already. I don't want to get into these details. This is violence. This is a police violence. This is a regular police violence. I don't know. I, I don't like concentrating myself on stuff like this because actually that's a really torture real torture stuff and so when you do the stuff like this to person um you gotta be fucking laughing your ass because that's i bet the fuck they're doing this criminals in blue uniforms this actually un-uniformed police officer from novo mesto police station because uh, that's what the fuck you do, right? When you do this stuff like this, you don't do this stuff like this to regret. You want to hear this fucking story. You want to be recognized for what you are. That's all. Um, Russians insisted on how that's going to be. How they wanted to teach me how it's going to be. It's not about that they wanted to teach me. They wanted me to acknowledge you know, how that, that's the way it's going to be. That's the way it's going to be. And I told them, no. If you're going to do this stuff, you're going to bend um, where, you know, where the hands are attached. You're not supposed to do it like this. And they went fucking mad, angry with me. It was like, that's the way it's going to be. That's the way it's going to be. You understand? That's the way it's going to be. So, okay, that's the way it's going to be. All right. Both of these babes are going to work fine. 
and uh, at the end of the day playing with this thing uh, I like it I really really like it